Hello, if you're watching on YouTube, this was originally recorded on Twitch and is a basically just a community maps video, but I'm very excited to get back to it with a level that I didn't play when it came out back in September of uh, last year, 2023, uh, called Tales from the Red Districts by PDG and Kersher. I remember people said it was quite amazing. It's apparently a very big level, which is why I'm doing it single player. As planned. <laughs> totally planned. The anger management office level. Um, I've got a chat with, I'm chatting with Yakuza at the moment. In Well, he's chatting with me is really the problem with Twitch ultimately. But just mentioning another level that I had a while ago. I think I um, never actually ended up playing that, which is really weird. The anger management office level. So if this, if this doesn't take too long, I'll do that one afterwards. I, need to, I really need to update my spreadsheet on all these levels. It's a bit of a frustrating process. I just want to make videos and stuff, but it always becomes a bit of a bit of an effort for that. <laughs> I don't know. That's dialogue. Maybe I have to mute my music for that. That's good, good, good insight. Here we go. We're back. Let's just add some of the audio back in. A bit atmospheric. Everything. Yet yeah, there are no words. On, there are no. There's no sheet music, man. What are you doing there? Sorry. Yes, indeed, I did spot this. We've got the Kersher, the sn uh, sorry, no. Kersher is the guy who looks rather like the uh, Katana boss. And he has a pair of spectacles, shades, and a small little goatee there, which is not model. And of course, your PDG, the snowman. Um, I, I still know his characters from the snowman, the original animation of the snowman, the snow dog. It's a little cat in the corner. Oh my goodness, how cute that is. It's a little prefab. Coltrane Avenue 40, don't disappoint us. Is that proper law? This is a proper jazz, smooth jazz music. Having a steak dinner with PDG, yeah. Well, well yeah, <laughs> it's pretty much what's going on. Don't forget to set your sound effects to 20%. Music, music to 100, okay. That, I, you won't be able to hear me if, if I do that, unfortunately, but I've got the um, offset is similar-ish. Unfortunately, it will be very difficult to hear some of the dialogue, but can we just leave? There we go. Tales from the Red District. You can see already this is an incredibly cool level. Like, I, you see this from the thumbnails and from the uh, like screenshots available with it. Awesome car free prefab as well. Let's get in it. Let's go. Let's see what the level has to offer. It's nice nowadays, in many ways, that you don't always expect combat from this game. In, because, even though that's a stellar part of it, it's certainly not. Oh, I'm outside of the fucking map. Oh dear! I have to go through the loading screen again. <laughs> oh god. I'm assuming that's absolutely nothing to do with how the map's built, it's just the way the game has decided to flip. Again, yeah. Uh, the, in the intro diner administration. Very cool. Okay, so there's a blood trail leading from the, I don't know, the little miniature restaurant we're in, to the car. Get into the car. We appear to be... Whoa! That is amazing! Sorry, I've never seen anyone play this or in a video or... Otherwise, that's a fantastic little thing to make in this game. How do you do that? Just with lots of primitives and things. These little top-down car maps. Oh. I'm going to have to turn up a little bit. Charging must be here. Hmm. A little bit of exposition. He must be here. Uh, I didn't actually hear who it was. I'm afraid I didn't read all of the lore very carefully. All right, we bust down the door like in that one movie. Bang! It's private. Let me in, please, I beg. We need a blue key. Ah, there was a yellow key next to uh, PDG at the start. I hope I didn't need it immediately. Hang on. Okay. I'm going to be out here for a second, so just looking around. It's a nice little box prefect. Greetings, Captain B. How's Fazerman? Where is Charlie? Oh my god, there's a dialogue with button. Where's Chargy? It's somewhere close by. Don't now tell me there's multiple the dialogues. There are multiple dialogues. Go on. There. Now where's <laughs> That's bat? amazing. Oh shit. I should have known better. So here I am. Aced humanity defender. Not even able to. God, that animation is that moving along the screen is flawless. World. Well, looks like Goodness me. Out the same. Hello, Adam Amira. When the last of those nice to see you again. bastards was gone. The only job left very, very tied in with the law, this. ...was to cut out the rest of their cult with extreme prejudice. My god, this is impressive. Three years ago, we have a hat and a gun of some sort. The guys who rushed in, I don't think I could have done anything there, could I? What if I cut the deal with they still have rushed in and it would still have been thrown out the window, I don't know. We'll never know. Well, I could go back and try it out. No smoking. 
certainly not fussed about that too much. Hey, we've got a good lad with us. Take the revolver. Seems to be it seems to be ours. This is certainly part of UHDF. It looks exactly like it, except for the doors, which we don't have in the editor, sadly. But all of this servo stuff is very much the same. I do hope that the audio balancing is good, by the way. Sorry if it isn't. If it isn't, do let me know. I, 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 I'm not going to be offended, <laughs> I promise. So clean up the following caves. Cave 713, 088, and 427. Hello. We've got Cave 713 available, haven't we? Lost. There's a man or something. Have I taken the poster? This is amazing. This is like a new game. Well, I am so sorry for the people who aren't able to run this on their machines, because this is just fantastic. This is like... I don't know. Get a good hit in there, will you? I see the boys from UHDF are coming with me. It's going to be fine. It's good, he says it's good. That's phenomenal. Right, let's get, let's get some health. I assume we can now leave. It's a small little extraction. Just get in and out sort of job. I wonder if there are any secrets. I haven't seen any such yet. Oh, it's crossed off. Got some uh, little props from beneath. We've recovered, perhaps, or something like that. A little lectern. The detail is just astonishing. I can't imagine what this level looks like in the editor in terms of the stuff that is there. It's also been recovered. Is that the other sort of thing? Recovered from there. Oh, hello. Right, very good. Take him down, lads. I wonder who the missing guy was. We'll see if there's anything to do with that. I, I just, I am just amazed. It's someone who's played this game for so long. I've not really, I can't remember seeing a level that felt quite like this before. This felt like it could be a mod for the, for the game rather than actually just ingenious editing skills for the editor. Quite ingenious. I was the best until that day. The best until that day. It's a bit stereotypical. Is that a cat? That's the guy from the start. God. Amazing. As I said, it's a bit stereotypical. It's just still pretty cool. I am not too bothered by that. Ooh. Machete. I don't know. Hang on to that, probably. Not that there's no options for what to get in terms of weapons, but still. Here we go. Some more recovered items and cages and boxes and all sorts. This is a slightly larger cave, this one. Going into a Kirsch map. It can, only, it can only be good. I know what you mean. Yeah. Chicago Roof Orphan was quite a hit. Uh, Tequilibrium was quite a hit. Yeah, that other level that I've I can't remember the name of the one I'm thinking of. Sorry, I I played it though definitely before on the channel, I believe. Have I definitely played it before? Not 100%, but I think I have. Oh, right, here we go. Very good. All the people are down. What about the missing lad? It's a bunk bed that's been flipped over. Oh, a few things here. Pickaxe. Might be a bit better for the moment. The curves around here. Could this be something? There's a charger who's a friendly with me. Oh, hello. Whoa! Charging! Goodbye, Group King. Very, very kind of you to drop in. Uh. Oh, what do we have? We've got a pet charging. Adorable little boy. Did he bite my hand off? Oh, he's got more power. Don't shoot him. My sunbeam in this carnival of blood. He's still got a his end. Anything like that. I went Beautiful. into retirement. A week later, UHDF was shut down. What an animation! And it's very simple, but it's very I cool. Care. Oh George my word. How hard world. was this to make? After all these years, I finally found myself a friend who never lets me down. Little Chargy. My little sunbeam. But my happiness didn't last long. Seeing I made a mistake. The buildings going across each other is just astonishing. It was Chargy's birthday. What attention to detail. He needed a new collar. Attention to realism. The store across the street had one. Oh. It's the only thing he can't chew. That beast has eaten two couches, a bed, a 44 Magnum, and a radiator. But I still loved him, and eventually recovered the Magnum. Hello, boy. Got a UHDF poster still, of course. Uh, this is a very nice little building. It'd be nice to live here. It feels like Cardiff. <laughs> I don't make too many comparisons to stupid stuff that has no relevance to this little map, but that's not stupid a city in the UK, but still. Find the pencil across the street and buy a new collar for Charlie, then return here. It's spelled a bit differently that time, I wonder if we've had a, a cutification of the name, I don't know. Something like that. This is all the same level. This is not a mini series of levels. I just, I have to pinch myself to remind myself of that. There's an entire The Thinker statue is out here. Am I, am I actually trying to resolve these, or am I just ruining everyone's lives by taking the posters down? There's a dog who's missing. No. Another excellent looking car proof. Same one from before, I think. There's a different colour. 
Oh, this is an amazing level. Yeah, I I just kind of forgotten about this one. I obviously I heard about it when it came out and everything. People were furious that they made a collaboration level that's so good. Is this the one from the contest that they was the people were cross with because it was so good? Which kind of is ridiculous in itself, but it, I I know what they mean. It's certainly an incredible product of everything. What was that? Sort of shattering wooden planks and things. It's very cool. Here is the pet store, I should say. No refunds. They're very clear about that. Collar. Uh, Oh, don't tell me this actually works. I've got a nice green one. There we go. Thank you. Uh, I don't have any money as such. I assume that that's all good. Waggies. This is an entire another proof that they've added. Another, the detail. I should stop saying that. I've said the same things over and over. It was the level from the contest, yeah. Now, obviously I heard about it. People said it was amazing. I didn't think they was... I think they were understanding it. But anyway, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just play the level and look at things now. Obviously the tree, few, tree um, props do save a bit of space, as usual. The buildings are fantastic, though. Them. There's no real need to include all of this, but they still do. And the train moving by up there. Look at this. I mean, it's just astonishing. It's like an adventure game almost. It feels like Silent Hill in a weird way. I don't quite know why I think that. Oh no. Chargy! Chargy, my son Bane. He had disappeared. Oh no! I couldn't find him anywhere. Three. Whoever they were, oh, they got Chargy. Why? They wanted me to kill Basiman. Me. It's a blackmailing a step tactic, is it? Your crew. Looks like a revenge of the damned cult. I could feel my retirement life flowing down the drain. Guess it's no good trying to hang on to something that's already gone. Goodness me. This is tragic. And really impressive still, as I keep saying. Get in your car and find your pet. John Wick style room, can we get ourselves something? It's not quite sandbox, but it might as well be. <laughs> oh my word, what are that's very cool looking. Did someone make these like Mac 10 slightly kitted out looking MP5 SD weapons, the underbarrel grenade launcher variants and stuff? It's fantastic. Do you know someone who made those? They're, I'm out of yeah, so do I. I mean fantastic, wouldn't it? We'll make do with these, of course. Is this a complete sandbox room? I don't know exactly, it might as well be. We'll grab this gun just in case. People are always uh, befuddled by the lack of guns in the game. I kind of do understand what people mean, but people also complain about the gun combat. So I think there's there are more priorities. You might you might say. Let's go. Everyone A drive in Red Town knew who Vasman was. Everyone knew Red where Town. he lived. So Back. it was not a tough call to find this pile of muscles. The real problem was to put him down. Oh, God. It was getting cold outside, but things were about to heat up soon enough. Yeah, boss, we uh, kidnapped the protagonist to paint the sound red's uh, charger pet. It's a dog. Is it the lost dog? There's a van over here. What's this for? It's a very, very nice looking van as well, isn't it? truck. Could you speed on Acrophobia someday and record it? Yeah, that's a good idea. I could even do that in the stream if you wanted, particularly. I just look at suggestions on things. What was this? Lost. As a child who's lost. I wonder if that maybe these are just like collectibles that I can look at the end. I don't necessarily... I think that's a good time based on my experience. Press the button. The doorbell. Uh, hello. Can you let me in, mate, please? Hello? Mate? Oh, okay, kill him. Just jump, we'll break in then. Boosh. Come to the door, or you, I will shoot it down. <laughs> that is Vassman, yes, I, I guess, don't worry. Can I get him? This doesn't work anymore, this glitch. What, what, have I broken the level by pressing it too many times? Is it possible to break in somehow? Am I, can we get through the garage, maybe? Have I done something wrong? Oh, I'm sorry. Scaffolding. Oh yeah, you're right. I'm just going through an upper window. What is going on here? So he's a boxing champion. He's got the whole floor match shebang. Is he sort of a Muhammad Ali competitor, perhaps? That's what it appears to be. The di oh my god, it's all the same level. It's amazing. And how about you? Actually, that did not very much. Okay, that's amazing. Chicago Roof Walkers uh, advert on the television. I recommend that level series too. Go and check it out if you haven't already. Oh my god, what do I- Okay, this is very bad if I- I'm gonna have to use Berserk here to do this. 
your, your boxing powers are nothing compared to that of God. Such as myself. Thank you for the advice on that, by the way. Sorry, I was being really dim. You can sort of press the bell, I assume that was it. But uh, there's actually much more to this level than meets the eye. As I I'm constantly being proved. Is he an alcoholic? Uh, possible. There's quite a lot of alcohol bottles. Hell of a lot of trophies, though. And a hammer. Right, hang on. Do we have this briefcase somewhere? Do I just have it automatically? Am I being even dumber? There was a message on the car. Let's read it. Oh. Door is open. Get Vasman's briefcase from the office. Yeah, that's that's exactly what I had imagined. See that Vasman got lots of money selling artifacts found in beneath. It's quite a uh, luxurious Turned office. He was an even bigger bastard oh, yes. than I thought. So Chargy is um, who we need to hand the briefcase into, I presume. Where's all the light coming from? Oh, it's just—it's actually just light emitting from this to tell you where to go. That's how that's how blind I am in these. A blood particle from downstairs. Oh, I'm sorry. The police arrived. They won't know what's happened. They think it just blew blew up. I, I got it. Well, here I am. Looks like I'll have to fight my way back to the office. Oh God. He gets away. <laughs> it's about to kick off paint the red style, I think. Fifty shades. Another poster. An old man has been lost. I think he's just fully dead at that point. I mean, even I'm having some frame trouble in this. Can't imagine what kind of rig PDG and Kershaw are running. <laughs> what kind of rigs? testing this and they're having such patience with it. God, what a remarkable band. Got that, that style of microphone, all the guitars, all the instruments are out to play, and it's Southeast Games themselves. They're out here. That's very dupe style Charleston music. This music is fantastic, it is. It's the sort of stuff that's, I suppose it's almost halfway to Electro Swing, but it was pretty, pretty similar to how it sounded at the time. Right, let's have a, let's have you. I'll just shut up for a minute and do some idle fighting to this wonderful music. Or I might not. He won't die. Huge hands, Hans has come back to fight, clearly. Oh, CGF, you're coming, you're ruining the stream now. Out out outrageous. <laughs> uh, not really, don't we? So many tumor head people, what do you mean? Tumor hand, right, see. They're all strong, the strong enemy type, and I'm afraid there's not much we can do about that in the editor, is there? If I remember correctly, this is something that's pretty much fixed. You, can, you can't make them with that, okay. We've got very magnetic, very absorbent light fixtures here. I'll have a bit of first aid, Governor. That'll, be, that'll do me. I'm gonna pop in through here, lads. I uh, don't see any more obvious weapons. So we are certainly in a bar fight. Oh god, hello. This is not easy. Let's do a shock over here. Hopefully we'll get a bit of damage. Not too much. Is there a rack of knives or something we can use, maybe? Depending on how long this takes, this might be only one of the only community levels I've played today, to be honest. I'm not sure what will really happen with it. Get out of your nunchucks, will ya? There you go. There you go. Fantastic. Oh, who else we got? Band. Bang. <laughs> the microphone. Uh, sorry, the singers, I should say. I was going to say the microphone users. How are the runs going today? Uh, it's not runs at the moment, but I will go to some later. I'm going to do some jazz punk runs later. I'm planning to anyway. Doing community maps at the moment. Well, so far it's just been this one. This amazing, huge, amazing, fantastic community map. Just taking me quite by surprise. I thought it was I thought it was gonna be good, but not quite this this remarkable. How yeah, good it is. Anyway. It's going well, thank you. No more electro swing. Yeah, the band have been uh, decommissioned, I'm afraid. Permanently. So get a guitar or something from here. Ooh, it's a little beneath trolley. You are quite a large gentleman, aren't you? 
hasn't really helped him that much <laughs> to do things. Sorry about Steam notifications, by the way. I know everyone will be able to see them. But uh, it's not ideal. Never looked at a Beneath run, I saw Beneath and runs the title. Oh, fuck, I forgot to change the title again. Um, I don't suppose, Tipo, you could change the title or CGF. I think you might have the authority to do that, just to community maps or something. Just replace the Beneath bit. Beneath runs. If you are able to. You're not, you might not be able to, in which case I'll just do it. He drank a lot of milk, that's why he's so big, yeah, fair enough. So the question I'm wondering is how do you get upstairs? Have I missed a staircase? Gotta fight your way to the top. Oh, there's a little whole area back here with a pool. Going on. And another blue key card, <laughs> just in case you missed it. Originally, that's probably a very helpful suggestion, actually. There's a staircase back here, of course. These people were rather unmoved by the fighting out there, weren't they? I wonder if it's actually ne necessary to kill all of these very strong people. It might not be. Let's see if we can go up here and have a meeting. Hello. Get, let's let, me, let me in here for a second, lads. I just need to quickly inspect your uh, car's warranties or something. Oh, here's the office. I, sp I presume this is where the game began. Where the level began, rather. All right, Justin. Uh, no worries if you can't, that's fine. I'll change it in a bit. Justin. Juice. Ju I don't pronounce it Justin, to be fair. So we, we haven't got any anything yet. We need to... Uh, Kill everyone, do we? Damn it. I was hoping to avoid that. <laughs> Doesn't matter. I'm gonna let these guys out on the balcony and then run back inside. I could do with Berserk, probably. These guys are just fighting themselves. They're having a poker game until a moment ago, but they realise everything's fickle and life is futile. This is Tales from the Red District by PDG and Kersher, the contest level from a while ago. This was uh, remarkably well received, I remember. If you haven't, uh, well, I've said a few times, but just repeating it for the moment. There are a remarkable lack of sort of good weapons. I suppose it's quite realistic. The cat has shown up again. Whatever it is, or maybe it's a different cat. I don't know. Let's get some weapons from here, shall we? Didn't cause a lot of fatalities, but it'll do. God, he went, for, went in for the kill there, didn't he? Look at these strong enemies. <laughs> so many tough enemies. Can we get ourselves a machete here, is there? Basically, people do have weak skulls to some extent. Just have a lot of health. If you get them in the brain or the leg, that's good. Oh, it's a katana boss with a pimp cane. How cursed. Fantastic. The lighting, by the way, is uh, remarkably good in this level. It's it's always more or less bright enough to see, and there's highlights to tell you where to go if you're not familiar. I do some more first aid somewhere else. Even Mr. Skelly, this is from this is Tales from the Red District. Yes, indeed, people have recognised it. It's nice of people too. You know, pay dividends to the level. So I'm not keeping up with chat religiously. Um, yeah, I need to change editor terms. That's fine. I will. Uh, I will change it myself in a moment. I'll change it now. Just off the call. Right. Whatever. Let's change it. Uh, paint the red. Community maps for world record. <laughs> There we go. Dan is now healthy, and I'm the healthy man. I'm yes, indeed. <laughs> so why did you think of that independently? <laughs> That's amazing. Sorry about that. If you're watching this on YouTube after the fact or something. Anyway, I recommend checking this level out for yourself. It certainly seems challenging and interesting, but you may need quite a good computer. Of course, yeah, map suggestions are fine. I can't guarantee I'll actually play it, but because I'm in a stream at the moment, I'm happy to play things that you suggest. Yeah. I suggest that I might do Acrophobia in a minute again because um, Adamira wanted to see how it was run and everything, but um, yeah. Rooftop Mini Golf Kill Fest. Yeah, no way. I, I, I think a lot of people won't be able to run it, don't worry. It's not on your end. A Killer's Eye in single player. I should do that now I know what to do. That's not a bad idea. Of course, Justin's level from one of the previous contests. Oh my god. They're so... I don't want to die here. Is there another health box? Because I have to restart everything, and it is an amazing level, but if you die, it's just it's like dying in beneath. You just have to do a lot of the same thing again. I need to get Berserk. I already wasted a couple of like power bars on shockwaves and stuff. Make this the map cup run. Well, that would just piss everyone off. <laughs> Actually, it's probably going to still be able to run it, so it wouldn't even do anything. Sadly. Are there enough people in here to justify Berserk? I don't think there are. Oh man, with a red tie now on the floor in pieces, very nice. Jared Fogel Foundation Part One. Okay, 
I will try and remember that. I, 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 I'm aware of that level, by the way, of course. Oh, God. Right here. Elevator is locked. Security breach. Oh, God. We go down there. That seems like a portal directly to beneath. Let's give it a go. Oh. No fall damage. That's good. Are you still here? Captain B. Oh, God. <laughs> no, no, no. No, no, no. I've just guns have been brought out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get some help first. I didn't think there was anybody left. Oh, goodness me. I don't know if whether to continue that now or to come back to it. Like, it's it's going to take me another half an hour to get to that point, probably. 20 minutes, I suppose. Might do another level for it in the meantime. But I'll come back to it later in the stream if people want to see the rest of it. Yes, I know. I'm very bad about health. I, I always overestimate my abilities. I have played Soul Jumper before, actually. I, I think the video might have got taken down because I used a song in it that wasn't allowed to. Thank you.